Are you glad that you're here? I am glad I'm here. The Bible says, and I was glad when he said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. And Father, I thank you so much. This is your house. This is the house of the Lord. Amen. Where I can go out with gladness in my heart. Praise be to God. Amen. For where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. You know, Brother Dennis, when he was leading the worship, he began with, he said this, it's nice to see your blessed faces. Your blessed faces. And one of the things the Lord always brings me back to is what is a blessed face? We need to be reminded of what blessings really are. Psalm 103 says, you know, bless the Lord, oh my soul. Ephesians 1, bless God. Amen. And, and, and forget not all his benefits. And, and Jesus always brings back to my mind, you know, the churches, I am blessed and highly favored. I am blessed and highly favored. But what are these blessings that make us blessed? Jenny is saying, the people that want to destroy your life, when you're truly blessed, there is no man that can curse you. You, you can't be cursed. And Jesus, first of the message, the first of the thing he ever taught people was all about blessings. And he wanted me to remind you as you reminded me of what true blessings are. Amen. And not to forget it. The, the thing I would always encourage you to read is Matthew chapter 5. Amen. The first 15 verses. If one just read it, read it till you know it. Off by heart. Amen. And then when you feel troubled, or you feel people are cursing you, or feel people are trying to take things from you, let's look at what Jesus says that makes us blessed today. The first thing, blessed are the poor. Poor. And theirs is the kingdom of heaven. So if you lose your job, you're blessed. If you have no money, you're blessed. If you want me two mites, to put in the offering, Jesus said this widow woman is put in more than all the rest. She's blessed. Amen. That's what makes you blessed because when you have nothing, you realize all you have is the kingdom of heaven. Praise God. That is true blessing. Amen. And not to forget that, God said to Israel, don't when you get fat and flourishing, beware you do not forget the Lord thy God. For blessed are the poor. And there's the kingdom of heaven. Next one. Blessed are those who mourn. Are you mourning today? I see tears from Sister Dairene. Tears from Sister Bing. Last week, tears. A lot of tears. And amen. Praise God for Sister at the back. Grace. Huh? Tears past the Jay at the bottom, hiding in the corner. Tears from Jenny there. This is a place of mourning. We've got real souls in this place. But that's what makes us blessed. Why? Because we turn to God for comfort, Lord. He's my only comfort. That's what makes us a blessed house. Amen. Praise God. Blessed, Jesus said the next. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst after righteousness. If you don't have poverty, if you don't have mourning, then you won't have hunger. It's an equation. One plus one plus one. If you don't have these things, you won't have the hunger. God's trying to bless you. God's trying to create a hunger in you by giving you mourning. Amen. For those who mourn, we seek the comfort of God because this world offers me nothing. I have a broken toe. Amen. Bleeding. Amen. You can see the bone that I'm walking every day 20 miles. Amen. I don't even want to go to the doctor. Lord, heal me. I want your comfort, God. And I'm not knocking people who go to the doctors. I'm not. But I want the comfort of God. I know God can help me. I don't want to go to man for comfort. That's the Holy Spirit. And then Jesus said, and blessed, amen, the meek. See, except we suffer these things, we'll never be meek. You'll never be meek. The world has meekness. But if they don't have poverty and mourning and these things, it's not a true meekness. And blessed be the mass of fool. Unless we suffer and we are low. And Apostle Paul said this, Jenny, I have the sentence of death in myself. That's all you can see. Amen. That my hope may only be in God. And that's the blessing. It's not what the world teaches is blessing. Blessed are you to a pure in heart. And you shall see God. 
These are the things that make you pure. I'm a very filthy person. Very filthy, but it's my poverty. It is my mourning. It creates in me, creates in me a clean heart. That's what makes us blessed. Our mourning is making our hearts pure. Blessed be this number seven. Blessed be the peacemakers. We want to make peace. You know you can make peace? Jesus called the Prince of Peace, but you can actually make peace. The world wants to make bombs and make cars and make microwaves and make pianos and make, make drugs. But we can make peace. Amen. We can bring peace wherever there's not peace. Wow. That's the blessing. And then the last two, blessed be you who are persecuted for righteousness sake. You're doing the right thing, you're going to get persecuted and you're blessed. Wow. And the last one, blessed be you when men hate you, revile you, and say all manner of evil against you, like you're saying, Jerry. You're blessed. That's what should make you smile. For so persecuted, they have the promise before thee, but great is your reward in heaven. And I always look back on these verses. Amen. For God for reminding me what truly blessed is. Praise be to God. And here's one last thing. So that's nine. That's nine blessings. For the nine planets in our galaxy, they're the things that makes us blessed. And the prophecy God gave to me is this prophecy. Grace, grace, God will supply all your needs according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Amen? Let's say that together. Grace, God will supply all of your needs according to his riches and glory. Oh man, are you not excited to that sister? Come on! Jesus means it. Why? Because this is a house that is blessed. And you brought your morning sister before the throne of God. And that makes you blessed. And that prophecy is for all of us. No matter what we are going through here, no matter what we're going through, God is supplying all of our wants, wants all of our needs according to his Riches! We are going to feel rich! Yeah. I am rich! Because my needs are being supplied! Amen. And that's only possible if we come to a house. Amen. 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 That is truly blessed in those the joy of the spirit of mourning. God bless you. Amen. Amen.